players know their goals are still out there, but they're not talking about it. For Tennessee, it's all about 1-0. and It's not better the last couple of games. There's Bray slinging it near side. Catch. Made by Hunter. Still on his feet. Down to the 11-yard line. Andrew Wilton. Well, they go corner blitz with E.J. Gaines, and there's a nice little pocket behind the corner that blitzes and the safety over the top that has a responsibility. 58 percent, though. That is only eighth in the league in terms of touchdowns in the red zone. Gray will throw it to the far side. Marlon Lane, 21. Rajon Neal is your tailback. He gets a good cut block, allowing Bray to hit his tie. Bray. That's plenty of time. Sails it over Hunter's head. Out. Watch here when he just hitches right there. There's Justin Hunter. Freeze it. Top of the screen. Wide open. Just give it to him. Then he's got him again, and then it turns into a bad throw because he feels ankle injury. Bray over the middle. This is big time. In. Now as a senior. Coverage down. Missed that one. And pressure again, trying to set up the screen. There goes Marlin. Still within the wheelhouse of Tennessee, picking up this first down. Gray looking for Hunter to make a play. Go up and climb the ladder, working against E.J. Gaines, and he falls asleep. Hunter does a nice job of tracking the football. You know, it's easy. You got a couple of playmakers, big-bodied guys on the outside. Thanks, Carroll. First down. Bray looking to sling it. Down the middle of the field, looking for Hunter to make another play. This play was actually a defensive play as he back. Defensive back. Braylon Webb's got an interception. Right here, the ball's thrown. Way inside, away from Hunter, and it's just that. Four-man rush. Over the middle pass is caught at the to Hunter. Just a simple end cut, but watch him step in, and then it is just as pretty as you can get. Away. Spray over the middle. Here's Patterson. Cuts it back. Down to the 25 yards. Stronger. It had injury problems, and this is the result. That is a tight spiral right on time to Cordero Patterson, and he is unbelievable after the catch. Look at that. He can make throws, Dave, that the North really settled in. Over the middle. Gain of five. <laughs> I just get fired up watching Tennessee on film. He is super dangerous. Get some heat from the Tigers. Bray flushed out of that pocket, throws it away, looking for. In their hurry up look. Averaging 485 a game. Over the middle, wide open is Zach Rogers. Coming off the back of it. Tenth play of this drive. Thirty-eight current players on roster, the NFL roster. Here's Bray steps up in that pocket, little shovel pass goes to Marvin Lane, and he's out to the yards against Tennessee. Seven for forty-five yards. Here's Zach Rogers. He's out and spun around. Shoulder fake. Good high catch from Justin Hunt. Fifteen or second and twelve. Ray steps up. Nice. Pulling to Romero inside the 40. That's half of a game. That pass is caught. Again. Now they are when they go too deep and spread it out, but now you can run the football. Bray over the middle. Throws a bullet. Pass caught by Hunter. Down at the fence trips him up. And they hit this in the first window. Freeze it right there. There's the first window. Right as, as Hunter's coming out of his cut, the ball's in the air. Usually, it's a little more development of the play. Off the board, and now you're looking at first down. Bray will throw over the middle, looking for Hunter. Did he make the catch? Oh, my goodness.
goodness, what a coverage, coverage. But watch where Tyler Bray puts this football. Right where only Rivera can make a play. Replay. Watch it right here, where only Rivera can catch the football. If you talk about squeezing it into a tight area, as critical as anyone, with him not being tough. A couple of fakes and Bray will throw it. That pass is caught at the 45-yard line. Goes for 18. Well, and that's what happens when you can run the football effectively between the tackles. Now the play action, you get Abner the physical back. And that's what they'll be searching for. Really only two receivers on our deep. And both guys deep routes. Hunter on the top of the screen. Patterson trying to come in a window underneath. And both ended up pretty much in the same area. Coming up to the C today. Three out of five on thirds. Bray steps up and this is Rajon Neal. Slip at the 16. Bray will throw over the middle. Has a man. Touchdown, Tennessee. 16. But James Franklin's inability to shoot the ball down the field, pretty easy for Tyler Bray. With his 10th catch of the season, this one goes for six, and the ball's out. Make the tackle. Over the middle, it's Rivera wide open to midfield. Bounces off Walker down to the 45 yards. On the outside. And watch right here, just leaves the middle of the field wide open. And a nice quick read by Tyler Bray to Rivera. And there have been some good tight ends, good tradition. Tight ends here at uh, Tennessee and Witten and Luke Stocker. Here's Bray, he'll be dropped back at the 48-yard line. Here's Bray, scrambling around. He'll fall forward to the 42-yard line. Bray might pooch punt this, he will. End over end, wobbly kick that will scoot into the end zone. Bray hit as he throws. Pass caught by Hunter, he spins and will be pushed out of bounds. Watch him here, the arm strength with guys on him, being pressured. Really can't step into the throw because he'll, be, he'll take a sack. So the balls only need about six inches. Bray will carry it out over the 20. Ely hobbles off the field. Looks like he might have twisted an ankle. Bray, quick throw. Tennessee today, four out of eight on third downs. Bray dumps it off to Hunter. Needs to break a tackle. Can't do it. Play for a trip to a bowl game, that's for sure. Bray sails it out of bounds, and now... Pressure comes, Bray slips one tackle, but then throws it away. On this play, watch 57 with the pressure, gets his hands on Tyler Bray. Actually, it's Michael Sam with the pressure. Well, here we go, Bray. Bat him down, incomplete. Clock will stop at 30. Four-man front from Missouri. We'll try to set up a screen, and the Tigers read it so well. A little important for Missouri to try that last one to A&M. Bray going to the end zone on the first play. Looking for Zach Rogers. Oh. Under squeezes the throwing window right here. Just man across the board. And Ponder right there, last second, getting his head around. You know, the official can't throw the interference flag. Nice job. Nice the middle here's Patterson he's got the first down he's inside the 10 they'll spot it block on Randy Ponder a little shallow cross right there using the official as well as to pick and you see Rogers out fighting first and goal freebie here Dave. a couple of flags come in shoes earlier in the season well, that was a double whammy on. There's a saw the hole. Michael Sam with a head start defensively for Missouri. So now you're looking at first and goal again from the nine. They'll swing it. Here's Neal. He's down to the five. Give him a touchdown. 
space and watch number 70, Juwan James, right there, the right tackle. Just enough of Coney E special in that third overtime. Bray, here's Patterson. He's inside the 15. He's down to the 13 and still moving the pile. He might have got it. Rivera in motion across the formation. Here's Rogers. He will sneak it. Looking for Rivera and come. There it is. And Bray overthrew him. Taller than six feet for Missouri on the outside, and that's Kip Edwards at 6 1. Well, and it looked like Hunter may have stumbled. Tyler Bray swings it near side. And. Zach Rogers will have the first down at the 13 yard line. No replay from the booth. The heel definitely out of bounds on that two point yeah, conversion. I, I'll give you that one. There's Lane. Boy, Hunter was twisted. Steps up, fires over the middle, pass is caught. Hunter, does he reach for the end zone and get a yes? Right here, a nice little shallow cross. Of the route that's really been killing Missouri all game long. Underneath routes, and then Hunter stretching. See the knee doesn't touch. The hand comes down to help propel him. Right there. That's a nice effort on the part of Justin Hunter. Take a look here. And you see Tyler Bray getting pressure. It's a nice job there defensively by Andrew Wilson, who has been in the right place in a lot of plays today. But you turn. Watch.